Hello, all you Vault Hunters out there. Commander Kingfish here, and we are back in Borderlands 3. We are trying to get to Tannis' hidden base, or her hidden hideout, because last episode we discovered that she was a siren. And so we were working our way through uh, to get to her secret base. So... Uh, I've already cleaned up the backpack a little bit, and so let's see if we can't uh, see what we can do here. I got picked up a legendary gun. I don't know how how good it is. We're just giving it a try out here. It's a pistol. Not too bad. Guess they couldn't hack it. Come on, me. Come on. And it is a torg, so typically what happens, you know, with a torg, once you run out of ammo. Alright, have we cleared some of this out? That was a bit of a firefight to start things off with. Let's see if we can get a little bit of ammo here to replace this, some of this stuff. All right. Uh, I am guessing we've got to get through here somehow. Oh yeah, I see more over there. Let's uh, go up here first. Uh, no, we don't need any grenades. Ah. Okay, what do we got? I get it now. We're all Out of there. Ah, uh, you know what? We need to switch to a different gun. Actually, let's pull out the sniper. Where, where, where's my sniper? At? Yeah, that's a little better. For you. Okay. Oh, thought I got far enough away. And boom goes the dynamite. Yep, there you go. Where they all go? All right, I'm looking for that badass. Where'd that badass go? Ah, we gotta reload here. Yep, yep, let's, uh... That was a good shot. There's one left. Who is it? Where you at? Oh, you look guy. Oh, seriously? Oh, I see something over here, though. <laughs> There's a broken clap trap. Looks like that guy's kind of excitement. Listen up, kids. Sometimes thrills can kill. Sure, a sure. A functioning sure. pair of CL class arm units? Maybe I'll finally know what a hug feels like. Uh, okay, Clappy. All right. Ah, let's see what we got in here. I have a feeling I know what's in here. Oof. Oh, there we 
go. Stay down, scrub. All right. Okay. Oh, shit. Get out of here. Yeah, you. All right. Let's switch over to the combat right now. That's not bad. For you. Okay, we got somebody else coming in here. Alright, let's get these guys out. good to throw a grenade once in a while. And that's a pretty good one that I got equipped. It does pretty good at doing its job. Alright. What else we got around here? Anything? I don't see much of anything here. Uh, something over here in the back it looks like. Oh, there's a save point. Oh, I bet this is where we need to go. All right. Oh, here's a box over here. Ammo box. That's always good. All right. There we go. Okay. And yeah, we're not going to mess around upstairs. All right. Let's see where we need to go. Uh... Up we go. All right. Ooh. All right. Now cross that sky bridge. We must obtain my iridium amplifier if we are to stand a chance against those turrets. All right, Tennis. Whatever you say. I got a feeling we got to jump that. All right, let's get back here. Let's get a run at it. Okay. Oh, and there's... Uh... Oh, this is never good. Double kudos! My lab isn't far now. As my professors often said, you're making progress. Now please put down the blowtorch. Okay. Ah, save point. All right. All right. Oh, no. We got these guys out there. All right. What do I got? Do I got... Uh... That's combat rifle. Ah, uh, a shotgun. Well, let's go with this thing. Excuse 
Me? Oh, a badass. Oh, no. Oh, and he's a fire one. Let's get out. Come on. Let's. Oh, he came in here. Dang it. All right. We got him, though. All right. All right. That's got them all cleaned up out there. All right. Well, we need to get some more. So let's uh, go ahead and get rid of that stuff we just picked up, which would be that, and that, I thought I picked up three things. Well, I guess... I don't know what I... I thought I picked up three, but apparently not. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, refill. Okay. Of course, I just filled up with ammo, so that's not going to matter. Uh, we won't mess with those ammo boxes. All right. Vault Hunter. I am Sir Hammerlock, and I require you to hunt and kill things for me. You see, the Borderlands are full of rare oh, and dangerous crap. I will pay you top dollar for their trophies. Beware the Manrock. Additionally, kill the Manrock. Go. Tank Bark. Oh. Alright, let's get into this. This is just... we can't... The man bark. So the man bark's reign of terror is over. For now. Okay, I guess I did it. Alright. Let's get the hell out of here. Uh, all right. What do we got here? Anything? Uh, I might as well grab this stuff. Okay. All right, so we took care of that. Now what do we got? Oh. More of you guys? Pick the wrong fight. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm back. There we go. <laughs> A level. Oh. All right. One more. Oh, great. I have to take care of you. All right, that's that. Okay. Oh, bleed out. Oh, great. Let's just throw a grenade to get things started. He's on fire with these guys. Uh-oh, uh -oh, I need somebody to kill. Where are you guys at? Jeez, why am I always on fire? What's over here? The slaughter shaft? 
Oh, you know, that's kind of a... Uh, uh, it's a, like an arena thing, I think, if I remember correctly. All right. And that... I never could get up to figure out that uh, typhoon thingy. All right. So... Get things cleared out in here. Ah, no ammo. Come on. Surely I need some ammo. I need combat rifle anyway. No, oh, yeah, there's some. Did I not kick that over? Okay. Come on, money. Money's good. I honestly think we're starting to get close here. You're nearly there! But like everything and everyone on Pandora, it seems the elevator to my lab is irrevocably broken. You will need to find another way underground. Oh, great. Uh, somehow, that being an orange up there means I probably have to shoot the damn thing. So I have to break the floor, but let's uh, do the looting first before we do that. Okay, now that the looting's done, let's uh, take that out. The lab entrance is in the large cavern. I'm not sure I can be more descriptive than that. It, it's a cavern, and it happens to be large. Okay, Tannis. All right. Well, I guess this is where we, we've got to go down through here. All right. Crawling dungeons. Great. Okay. Alright, might as well take the loot while we can. There's gotta be crappy guns in here, I'm sure. Oh, well. I don't know what that is, but we'll take it. It's pretty. Let's grab you. Okay. And here's a couple of money boxes over here. One good thing about getting money is uh, is that uh, we can uh, buy upgrades. What's up? Slumming it in an abandoned mine. All right, all right, I got gotcha. you. Well, just wanted to let you know that we're working on it. I've got a big surprise for you. <laughs> Huge reveal. You're gonna love it. Troy, come on, we talked about this. Anyway, the Great Vault of Beckons! Later, superfan. Great. <laughs> okay. Alright, well, let's uh, do this. Grab that money. Still loading. Okay. Apparently, we don't need any. What do we got down there? Oh, no. More Varkids. Oh, well, hey, we can at least do Back this. Fail. The first time I ever heard the name of the Iridian homeworld was from Leda's own lips. We were driving across the desert in my dirt buggy when we came across some ruins. The bots scattered out, chirping and beeping. I keep an eye out for the racks while Leda starts digging in the sand. Then she looks up at the moon and says, Necro to Feo. As if she could already see it. Necro to Feo. <laughs> That's a funny name. Okay. Alright, more loot. 
Alright, well, let's go deal with the Varkids. Now, yeah, let's walk down. Let's throw a couple of, uh... Oh, that was a good one. Oh, come on, guys. Right. Another one down! And we're just shooting from the hip here. Okay. Well, it looks like we got them all. Okay. I'm guessing straight ahead is a good thing. God, Tannis, what'd you do here? Oh, boy. Bunch of them. Oh, good lord. Okay, where are you guys at? Come on. Okay. Let's take you out. Uh oh. Oh, there's another adult out there. we get them all? Well, I'm sure we got some of them anyway. I don't see anything down there. You were looking for a saucy little minecart called Kate. She will show you the way. We had a brief and tumultuous affair that ended when our tracks went separate ways, as they say. Ah, so it goes. Now, caress the minecart. Just trust me on this one. Say what? Oh, shut up, Kate. What? What? Okay. Uh, we've got a melee minecart, which is probably that right there. Uh, let's do this. What's that shield now? Oh. oh, yeah! Come on. There's another one somewhere. Where are you at? Oh. Above me. Alright. More. Good board. <coughs> oh, what? Where in the hell did that come from? Oh, above me. Okay, we get them. All right, let's clean up any loot. Oh, there's a oh, gee whiz. I hate barkets. Grab that. Grab the money. All right, we need to melee this thing. Barkets! Destroy them! If those things get into my lab, they could damage my precious equipment! Yeah, tell me about it. Not only your precious equipment, but they can damage me too. Oh, come on. I'm just shooting from the hip here, trying to take them all out. Now stroke my X once more. Again? All right. Thank you, Kate. We'll catch up soon. Now, Vault Hunter, the entrance is just down that corridor. You are nearly there. Well, that's a that's good. All right. Better uh, make sure we loot. All right, nothing there. There it is, my iridium amplifier. We'll need to bring it back to Roland's rest. Disable those couplings to begin preparing it for transport. Okey doke. Oh, we have a side mission. I never let anyone inside my lab. 
but for you, I will make an exception this time. Fine, fine. Okay, let's see. We do have a side mission down here. We'll grab it. Uh, all right. Let's do this. Okay. All right, so we have to disengage the couplings. Time to open you up. Oh. Let's, uh... Oh, I didn't want to do that. Let's get back out of here. Oh. I don't know what do we got here. Got a, le <clears throat> a legendary. Oh. Okay. Alright, so I'm guessing we've got to shoot those things to disengage them. And. Let's uh, come over here. Okay, so let's do this. There's one. There's two. And there's three. And there's four. Excellent. Now, lower the amplifier. I believe one of those switches is more than up to the task. Uh, okay. Where's the switch at? Where'd you hide the switch at, Tannis? Okay. Don't need any of that. Over here? Okay, yep. Load the reactor. Um, load the reactor. Oh, uh, something over here, maybe? Maybe over here? Let's get out of here. Oh, uh, maybe am I I'm missing something here? Try another switchboard. It's not receiving sufficient power. Oh, uh, all right. So that one. That one is on. Okay, try another switch. Oh, I see one. Okay, I see where it's at. Try this one. Well done. I see why Lilith always sends you to do, well, everything. For now, we can install the amplifier in Roland's rest. I've already instructed that human sculpture Vaughn to assist you in its transport. You can meet him in the garage downstairs. Hey, Vault Hunter. So, my head ghost told me to help you drive an Iridium whatever dealie back to Roland's rest for safekeeping. Still into it. Waiting for you outside. No rush. I got some sweet tunes. Oh, yeah, Digby Vermouth. Classic. Okay, all right. So, inspect childhood's end. 
All right, let's accept that. That's the child. Uh, all right. So now we need to put that in as a mission. All right? Uh, where are we at? Mission log. That one's the one we want. All right, so we're right here. Find the portrait. Okay. That's a portrait of Handsome Jack, before he became the torturing, mass-murdering CEO of Hyperion. Back when he was just a coder, a husband, and soon-to-be father of the aforementioned angel. There's a hidden chamber behind that portrait. You'll have to move it out of the way. Okay. Move the portrait. Don't worry. That button is perfectly disinfected. I never even touch it with my hands. All right, let's eat unlock that. From our findings in the vault, I believe sirens are able to imbue memories into physical objects. It may not even be a conscious effort. I recovered one of Angel's childhood toys. Start there. You are looking for a stuffed toy Thracian tetra bear. Just as cuddly as the real thing, minus the neurotoxic claws. Okay, Tannis, whatever you say. We're looking for a teddy bear. Great. Over here, maybe? Where are we at? <coughs> Alright, nothing in there. Uh, touch. Captain Bear, who is a bear? He is a bear. Captain Bear. Hey, Angel. And who is this guy? Well, we must be eating a lot with that big belly, huh? Hey, Angel, darling, what, what's that on your arm? Did you do that? Blue. I don't know where it came from. Do you think it's pretty? Yeah, sweetheart, it's, it's real pretty. Hey, uh, honey, can you get in here for a minute? I was correct. That was a memory from when Angel's powers first manifested. There are other items she might have interacted with. Look for an old vending machine. Okay, find the old vending machine. Uh, is it upstairs, maybe? Alright, so we have to get upstairs. Okay. Oh, is this it, maybe? There we go. Help me! God damn! He's a crap asshole! What's an asshole? Oh, Angel. Sweetheart, I'm sorry I didn't see you standing there. Uh, don't say any of those words that Daddy said, okay? Okay. Is the machine broken? Yeah. Looks like no candy for us. Hey. Why don't you go back into the waiting room with mommy, darling? Huh? The doctor's gonna be here any minute, okay? I think I can fix it. What the hell did you just do, Angel? Like most sirens, it seems using her powers became instinctual soon after acquiring them. She had no concept of what a phase shift even was, only that she could talk to machines, and more importantly, that they listened to her. There should be a turret somewhere in the room. Find that next. Okay. Find the turret. Okay. So we probably have to get up above. Oh. Grab the fuse. All right. Put the fuse in over here. Oh. Is this the way we gotta go? Find the Hyperion. Let's get rid of more barkets. 
Yeah, apparently this is the way we gotta go. And... Ah, you're not gonna sneak up on me. I heard you coming. Alright, up we go. And it looks like we've got to... Oh, okay, this does put me up above. Alright, another jump. And... Alright. Over here. Alright, well, let's do this. Find Hyperion. Okay. Uh. All right. So it looks like I think we got to get over there. <coughs> which is probably up here. <coughs> Maybe not. Ouch, ouch. Okay. Maybe over here then. Maybe this is the way we gotta go. Do this up, up over here. Ah, come on. Well, why aren't you let me stand up there? Pretty sure. We've got to go up. Or do we? Oh, okay. All right, we just turned that on. There it Simply is. Simply touch it to trigger the memory. Uh, touch it to trigger the memory, okay. Mommy! Daddy! Help! Look, you filthy bandit. Just give us back our daughter, okay? Are you kidding? She's a freaking siren. I'm gonna be a trillionaire. You and your wife get out of here before I sick my turrets on you. Forget the kid. Go make another one. Hey, what the? I want to go home! Oh, I get down! Uh-oh. No! No! Oh, crap. What the hell? Girl scars run deep. There's one more artifact. Look for a Hyperion communication satellite. And that's up. Um, let's see if we take that out of there. Yeah, there it is. Daddy, please let me out. No can do, my sweet little angel. You're in that chair for your own good, okay? Language. Look, sweetheart. 
I can't let you out because of what you did to your mother, okay? I just couldn't bear it if something else happened to you. I didn't mean to. Shh, I know, darling. That's why you need to stay in that chair. But I got you something. That chair is connected to the entire Hyperion network. Now you can see through every satellite we own around every planet in the sky. You've got the best view in the whole universe from that chair. We're gonna work together. You and me, kiddo. Sound good? Yeah. Okay. I love you, Angel. I love you too, Dad. Okay. Angel spent most of her life chained to Hyperion technology. With those memories, I think I have enough to fix the water purifier now. Go to Roland's rest, and I will attempt to interface with it. Okay, we gotta go to Roland's rest. Use. Okay, we could get back to Vaughn. <coughs> because that's gotta get us back to Roland's rest. So, let's do this. I think we need to... Uh, let's put in... This one. Because this is how we get back to Roland's rest. I think we. Uh, out this away? Alright. Where are we at? Am I lost? Of course I'm lost. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I can find my way out of here. Oh, maybe through this door? Yeah, here we go. Okay, this gets us back out of here. Back into this area. And now we've got to go see Vaughn. Alright. And that's over here, I think. All right, <clears throat> sandblast scar. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> All right, a little water, that always helps. Sandblast scar. All right. You ready, bro? Let's do this. Okay. Here we go. All I right. I listen to Digby Vermouth's velvety tones all day long. But my head lady told me we gotta move this iridium thing or thing. Okay. All right. Well, I tell you what, I need to get rid of some stuff. And. We are at 50 minutes, so I think this is actually going to be a good spot to stop here. Uh, we've got angels and speed demons that we're still working on. We managed to find Tannis' hideout, and now we've got to try to get back to Roland's rest so that we can fix a water purifier and get this uh, piece of thing back that we can uh, take out the turrets which will be a good start for the next episode. All right, all you Vault Hunters out there, if you like this uh, episode, please hit that thumbs up. It really helps out the video. And uh, please subscribe. That really helps the channel out a lot. All right, keep your heads low. Don't get shot. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here. And I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.